The first case of HIV AIDS was recorded in Namibia in 1986, and in the early 2000s, the disease was considered a death sentence as it destabilized families, communities, and created thousands of orphans. The Namibian government with its development partners have been working hard to invest in the health of its people. And as the world commemorates yet another World AIDS Day, Deputy Minister of Health was proud to announce that the situation has changed for the better. AIDS-related deaths have declined from 4,200 in 2010-2011 to 2,900 in 2013-2014. Since community involvement and participation is key to reaching desired outputs, mobilization of communities will be a key strategy for their engagement in order to create demand for HIV services, promoting adherence and strengthening behavior change. Let us change our behavior, all of us. Similarly, meaningful involvement of people living with HIV is critical to the overall success of the national response. Since 2008, the U.S. government has provided more than $8 billion Namibian dollars in support of the country's national HIV-AIDS response. That country's charged affairs says her government has recognized Namibia's exceptional role in combating HIV-AIDS in a number of ways. More than 83% of HIV-positive pregnant women in Namibia are receiving services to ensure that they do not pass the virus along to their babies. HIV incidence in Namibia has decreased by a remarkable 68% from 2001 to 2011, and AIDS-related mortality is down by 44%. Speaking at the event was 29-year-old Emmanuel Shefeni, who was diagnosed HIV positive in June this year. I am thanking God because all my friends, my family were very, very supportive. I did not experience any reject by friends or anything. I'm very thankful for that. And um, it's because of them that I'm standing before you, a very strong man. Um, I always put on the smile on my face. More than 122,000 people are currently receiving ARV in Namibia. And government says it will continue intensifying its effort of scaling down the pandemic.